I think people forget how easy it is to, if, if you're struggling with a particular service delivery manager or you feel like they're hijacking calls, pick up the phone, like, go and see them. Perhaps not at the moment, we're in lockdown. But when we're, when we're back to normal, go and see them, like, have, have a coffee with them, talk to them, go, look, what, what is it you think we're doing right? What is it you think we're doing wrong? What, what would it take for you to feel confident enough to allow us to run these major incidents without you feeling like you need to be involved? And that simple thing is, is really, really easy to do. Um, and also, it goes a long way to building your relationship with them. And by asking the question, you're demonstrating that you actually care about what they want and need. Um, and people are typically reciprocal. Um, it, it will mean they, they are more on board and they'll be looking to support you as well. And having that open dialogue means you're going to have a really quick feedback loop. Yeah. So when you get it wrong, you've now got more of a relationship. They can pick up the phone and say, do you know what? I felt this was wrong. This is where we need to be humble and kind of drop the ego and go, yeah, OK, maybe they're right. Or if they're not right, um, and, and you think actually no we did the right thing or in that situation you have a relationship that, that you can now do that in a in a far more constructive way that you can start that conversation so a couple of things I, I want people to think about is inspiring confidence right at the start of a major instance really really um, important and um, having dialogue with your service delivery manager whoever it is and building a relationship mm-hmm.